Hey, what's up everyone? This is Adobe One Glass here with a little demo about setting a really small flame for detailed drawing with glass or other small detailed work. So first I'm just going to, uh, oops, get my torch running. And for this exercise, <clears throat> We're gonna uh, we're gonna need our second second stage. So if you have a foot pedal, uh, activate it and then turn off your gas. So your second stage is still on if you were to crank open one of the valves. So the first thing I'm gonna do is set my flame. So this is really small amount of propane and I'm completely closing off my primary oxygen so that I'm only using my blue valve and with that you can get a really 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 small flame and just using your blue valve it'll actually uh, keep the flame a little bit off of the torch face so I don't know how well my phone can pick this up I'm gonna try to adjust it a little bit but if you can see up close, it actually isn't isn't physically touching the metal. So that you can do with just your uh, with just your um, propane and uh, blue oxygen. And so, so this one is nice because you can still leave your outer flame on, so that when you're you know you're doing detailed stuff you can kick on the outer flame to warm up your whole piece or keep everything hot. The second one I'm going to show is, you know, you're going to need your, your outer stage for this one. So you can get that really small flame there. And if you're worried about your torch heating up too much, you can open your outer oxygen. So right now all I've got is I've got just a really, really tiny flame and I've got my second stage oxygen open. So regardless of how small this flame gets, it's still going to be cooling the torch because you've got your outer oxygen on. Um, and this way you can have your outer oxygen on and then just turn on your propane when you need that extra, the second stage. So you just crack on the propane and it is, you know, you can turn it up to where you have your oxygen set to. Um, and this way, this will keep your torch cool no matter how small that flame is. Um, yeah, and I mean, it's itty bitty here. So, you know, and then also the other thing you can do is just hold, hold your piece a little farther away. So for something like this with a tiny stringer, you're not even going to be actually in the flame when it heats it up enough to melt because those stringers barely need hardly any heat to light. So as long as you have this tiny, tiny flame, you can, uh, you can do just about anything as small as you want. Um, and your torch will stay cool. All right. Thanks for checking it out. Hope you all have a good one.